Sam! Where are you? I want to show you something. Well, to be more exact, someone. Absolutely incredible! Come on, little guy. Oh, there you are! Watching Ninja Turtles again? Yeah, I can't stop watching them. Well, try. There's someone who wants to meet you. Who can I... Ow! Meet our possible new pet! We'll see how the rat will fit in here. Oh, forgive my ignorant friend, Master Splinter. What? Master Splinter? No, Sam, it's just a rat. Don't pay attention to her, Master Splinter. She knows nothing about you. Oh, Sam, your imagination sometimes really amazes me. Hey, where are you going? Put Master Splinter back! Let's give the rat some time to get used to the place. Don't bother him, Sam, or you'll scare him. Me? Scare? No, I don't do such things. Yeah, well, I'll leave for a few minutes. Behave yourself. Yeah, yeah. Master Splinter, Master Splinter! Your most faithful student is ready to learn. Have you come to teach me the art of the ninja? Yes, yes, uh-huh. I really want to learn. Please! Sam, why are you bothering the rat? I asked you not to. Well, I want to learn the art of the ninja. Oh, Sam. Sam, he's just a rat. He doesn't know any ninja art, but he's very smart. Come, I'll show you something. Fine. What have you got here? Are you making a craft? Yep, Sammy, a craft for our rat. Oh, a gift from Master Splinter! I approve. Ah, uh, well, not quite. And Sam, he's not Master Splinter. Hmm. <sighs> With the help of these cardboard pieces, we'll build a small labyrinth for our rat. And you'll be amazed to see how fast he'll find the exit. A labyrinth? Yes! Rats are very smart. They can quickly analyze their surroundings and find a way out of the most complicated labyrinth. This, this is very curious. I've never seen anything like that before. Guys, do any of you have a pet rat? Write about him in the comments. What will this labyrinth have? Well, there will be a sort of revolving door, a tunnel, a bridge, a seesaw. Well, you'll see if you're going to help me. Of course I will! There's no way I'm gonna miss this! Great, then let's get started. I have some parts here. Uh, go fetch a spinner, please. A spinner? Oh, no problem, we have loads of them. And meanwhile, I'll make a revolving door that will look like a piece of cheese. Two. Will the spinner soap do? Uh, no, Sam. We need an ordinary spinner. <sighs> well, all right. What about a chocolate spinner? No, Sam. A plastic spinner. The common kind. Like this? Yes, Sam. Like that. Oh, for the rat, I'm even ready to sacrifice my favorite spinner. Oh, <laughs> what? Sam, you haven't played with it for half a year. Meh. <laughs> Mere details. Oh, fine. Here, look. A triangle? Oh, like a piece of cheese? Yes, we only need to paint it. Say no more! Charge! Yes, yeah! Well done! <laughs> All these painting drills come off quite useful. I'll glue the spinner to the bottom part of the cheese. Like this. The first labyrinth detail is done! Ugh, it's hard being an assistant. Oh, Sam, they're just small sticks. Well, well, they're heavy! I'm tired. Well, go get some rest then. And I'll make a seesaw for our rat. Get some rest! I never know how a seesaw is made! <laughs> All right, then watch. I'll put five sticks together, like this. I'll glue this part made of a stick and some cardboard on. And another stick with holes to make the support. Let's connect the parts with a skewer. There! Not 
you. <laughs> oh, stop whining, Sam. Look here. Oh, uh, is it a field? It's the base for the labyrinth. Can you see the outlines for all the rooms? We'll glue the piece of cheese here. And the seesaw here. You also mentioned a bridge. That's right, the bridge is made of two parts. The base, which looks like a roll. We'll glue it here. And the bridge itself. We'll glue it in three places. Hmm, but it doesn't look like a labyrinth so far. I can see everything really well! <laughs> You're getting ahead of yourself, Sam. First, we'll glue on all the parts, and then we'll make the walls. What is this part? A tunnel! Let's put these holders on the ends of the tube. Will you find the place for the tunnel? Uh, let me think. Uh, here? No. Maybe here? No, Sammy. The tunnel will be right here. Oh, uh, well, all right. How am I supposed to know your plans? Guys, if you want to see more videos with animals on our channel, subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell button. Hmm, it looks like a basketball field. Yep, that's what it is. One of our rat likes sports. Well, he has lots to choose from. <laughs> right, I'll mark the start. And the finish. And now it's time to put up the walls. We have walls with holes. And without them. And of course, the entrance and the exit. And the last wall. Don't forget the of course I won't. There! We'll have this little gate at the start, or the rat will simply run back out. Uh, aren't you forgetting something? Do you mean the roof? <laughs> I remember. Come here. Let's cover it carefully. Oh, oh, oh will the rat have enough air? Of course, Sammy. There are lots of holes here that will let the air through. All right, then. Shall we call our guest? And the rat enters the labyrinth. We'll close the gates. Where will he go? The rat passes the revolving cheese door. Well done. And he comes to the basketball court. Do you think he'll want to play? <laughs> will he go to the bridge? No, nope, he's figured out it's a dead end. And through the tube he goes! Right, just a bit more. Wow! What a jump! And exit! Yeah! Wow, Sue! I hope you can see now that he's too smart for an ordinary rat. It's Master Splinter! <laughs> I can see it, Sammy. I'm sure he'll be happy to teach you the art of the ninja. Guys, give us a thumbs up if you like this labyrinth for our rat. And share this video with your friends! <laughs> Guys, if you want to know what happened after that video, leave a comment below. And while you're doing that, We'll get to our next interesting craft. Ha <laughs> ha! Let's go! Oh, so hot! I need to open the window. <laughs> Sam, don't! Or there'll be a draft! How can she hear everything? Fine, I'll drink some water then. 
<sighs> Cold. I should pour it. I spilled a bit. Fine. Oh, so, so I need help. <laughs> you need a boat, not help. Not funny. I was hot and I wanted a drink. But you went for a swim instead. So? <laughs> Fine. Come here, let me dry you off. Like this. <sighs> Thanks. But I'm still thirsty. I know. And there's a great solution for such a slick guy. Wow! How come I didn't know about this before? Well, it isn't candy. <sighs> Ah, phew. Not so hot, finally. Speaking of our candy. Ooh, Jelly Belly, will you please share? Sure! Let me open it first. <laughs> Need help? No, I'll manage. Oh! oh, Sam, what's the matter with you today? I just cleaned up. I'm sorry. I'll get the dustpan. Hey guys, did you know that Sam loves this channel just as much as he loves candy? And he really wants to have even more subscribers! You can help! Tell your friends about our channel! The more subscribers we have, the more videos we'll be able to make for you, and the more cool DIY ideas we'll have to share! You have our word for it! Ah, Sam, Sam! How does someone so little produce so much litter? I'm a genius! <laughs> no doubt about it, all geniuses are a bit weird. Yeah, but what? I've invented a candy machine. Here's the drop. Interesting. Pouring candies into the water cooler? Yes! I don't want this spilled candy situation to happen again. We'll put them into a cooler and then pour it into a glass like water. Cool, huh? Cool, but impossible. Candies can't go up. Oh, too bad. But they can go down. Wait, really? Yeah, we'll make your candy machine. But it needs some tweaking. Hi, guys. Today we're going to show you how to make a real candy machine. What do we need? <laughs> we need a pencil, a ruler, a paper knife, and a lot of boxes. <sighs> a moment. Yeah. Hmm, Sam, these are great boxes, but they're too small for a small amount of candy. Oh, this won't do. We need a large amount of candies. This means a large box. Oh. Yes, this'll do. Let's start with the body of our machine. I'll carefully outline one wall using a ruler and a pencil so it's even. And then I'll cut it out. Just like this. Be very careful when you work with a knife. It's small but very sharp. Better ask an adult to help. The first part is ready. Now I'll show you the measurements for the other parts. Here, to have it on hand, simply pause the video and take a screenshot or write it down. Now let's start connecting the parts. We need glue and lots of it. So, how many candy containers will there be? Five. Only five? Yes, five. Is that not enough? So many candies in the world and only five containers. Skittles, m and and so many others. I get it, you're an expert. But let's get back to work and start gluing. <sighs> the glue gun is the best tool for this job. We'll glue the walls onto the rectangular base and get some glue here onto the rear wall. And put it together. From here on, it'll be easier to work with the box. Let's make the base more durable with more parts. I'll secure it with an additional wall here. The 
there. The last two go to the bottom. One here. And one there. And leave the glue to dry. Now, let's make containers for candies. These are the measurements for the parts. Pause the video again and have it saved. First, we'll create supports out of the detail number three and a stick. Like this. We'll glue one part to another one. And then we'll glue it to the wall. And make another part just like this. And connect them with the detail number one. Um, how is my invention coming? Uh, your invention? I'm the one making it. And what are you doing? <laughs> the most important thing. What? I'm managing the process. All right, boss. Could you bring me an automatic pen? Yes, sure. But I'm the boss. I remember. <sighs> Let's continue. I'll glue this short stick to the piece number four. Add more glue here on the sides. And place it on the rear supports. Here, a pen and a contract. A contract? Yes, we must sign an agreement that I'm the inventor and you're oh, my assistant. Oh, I see. All right, give me the pen and I'll sign it. Huh, great pen. Just what I need. Hi, what are you doing? I'm making sure your invention works, boss. Ugh, fine, but the contract? Don't worry, I remember who's the boss here. Yes. It's me. <laughs> now, I'll put some glue onto the piece number five. And attach it here, like this. Now, I'll put the spring on the stick. And attach it to our container. Hot glue gun for life. Don't be shy with the glue. It should hold well. And now, cut off the excess. Let's add piece number six with a stick. And here we have a candy dispenser mechanism. I made a hole in the last piece number seven and now we'll put it right here. Now you just have to make four more of these. Don't tell Sam, but you can make more containers if the base is longer. What? You can make more containers? Oh, no, you've misheard me. You need more glue to keep it secured. Ah, that's good. Well done, Susie. I'll add a slope inside to make candies pour down easy. Looks good. We'll need more glue here. And now, I'll attach the containers to the base. I'll add a transparent window. Hey Sam, have you chosen the candies for the machine? Ah, it was hard. Only the best made it. Great! We'll add candy labels to make it clear which are where. I printed the labels on a sticky printer paper. And now, I'll get them on nice and neat. Now, nobody will confuse them. Who's gonna confuse candies? They're all so different. Well, you're the only expert here. And the rest of us need some guidance. We'll pour the candies into the containers. <sighs> Let me help! Uh, maybe I should do it. You've already opened one today. The containers are full, and now we can put the lid on. The candy machine is ready! Very convenient and nothing 
is spilled. <laughs> <laughs> Write in the comments which candies you'd put in your machine. Sam is very curious, and maybe he'll learn something new. Congratulations, colleague. It's a success. Colleague? You're not my boss anymore? You know, I think it's too much responsibility, and I'm too busy for this. Okay guys, this craft turned out great. If you liked it, give a thumbs up. And if you know how to make it even better, or using other materials, leave a comment below. While you're doing that, we are moving on to the next craft. Ah Here's a special tool for picking up cookies. Mm -hmm. Come here, my precious. <laughs> hey, Sam. Munching cookies again? <laughs> Samantha, what are you doing here? Well, in case you've suddenly forgotten, I live here. Besides, Sue asked me to feed Fluffy while she's away for a few days. Uh, as if I can't feed Fluffy myself. I'm sure you can. But if my dear sister asked me, uh, where is his foot? Uh -huh. uh, oops. Oh, well. I'm going to tell Sue. All right, Mr. Cat, fitting time. And who's going to throw this out? Look, if Sue's away, you will have to make a video for our subscribers. What? No way. Do it yourself, Mr. Genius Slime. You keep saying how crafty you are and all that. But, hey, no, I need an assistant. It's, it's the Kyle of our channel, Slime and his human friend! Nope, not my thing. Oh, oh come on! All right, fine. But you are going to help me. And mind you, I'm not Sue. If you slack off, I'm not doing it either. Fine, fine, got it. <laughs> hey, where are you going? It's the other way! Give me a moment. Looks like we're up for something not quite usual today. Get me some toilet paper. So, uh, how does it go? Oh, right. Uh, hi, everyone. Today we're going to make a. Uh, uh, what are we making, Sam? Uh, I don't know. Usually, Sue comes up with ideas. Give me that. Hey! Yes, right. Mm. Today we're going to make an Oreo machine. Give a thumbs up if you like the Oreo. Mm. Go on, Mr. Slime. Bring me some cardboard. And I'll see what we have in the tools department. Let's see. Um, nope. Oh, nope again. Mm. Oh, here, a pencil and a ruler. Eh, I'll bring the rest later. Here, lots of cardboard. Right. <laughs> First, let's measure the pieces we need. And you, Sam, we'll stack them up. Yes, Miss Samantha. Let's go. Oops. <laughs> First rectangle, 17.5 by 11.5 centimeters. Let's cut it. Oh, I didn't bring the cutter. I'll be right back. <laughs> What's the next piece? 12.5 by 11.5 centimeters. We need three. Right. <laughs> so let's give it a try. <laughs> I finally found the cutter. Are the lines ready? Yes, of course. I did well. I deserve a reward. What reward, Sam? It's your job, actually. And I'm just helping. Yeah, 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 Samantha. I forgot. <laughs> Go make a card for the machine. Oh, like a pass to the cookie paradise? Uh-huh. Something like that. Then I'm off to make it. Uh, what size? <laughs> Uh, well, like a plastic cart, I think. Got it! And plastic carts are always so pretty! I need to come up with a design! Quick! Ha! Felt pens and paper! Hey guys, do you like creating things like logos and such? Write in the comments! Right, looks like it's glued together. Yep! Sam, get the next piece. Here, 12.5 by 11.5 centimeters and a 5 centimeters hole. Yeah, yeah, give it here.
Here's the base for our machine. Now let's assemble a cookie wrap mechanism. It's the foam part. Now where? Oh, here! We need a strip like this, it's 10.5 by 2.5 centimeters. And a rectangle like this, it's 14 by 10.5 centimeters. They need to fit into the machine tightly. <laughs> oh, too tight! <laughs> Aha! I knew I could do it! And I need to insert the next piece at an angle. It's a cookie slide! <laughs> right on time! Snack time! No, time to work some more! Oh, well, the things I do for my subscribers! What do I need to do? Mm, one more piece! 11.5 by 12.5 centimeters! Fine! Where are you going? I'll be right back! Who's impatient now? Oh, guys, can you sit patiently while you're making a craft? Write in the comments! <laughs> I think we can use the towels like this. And I need this cardboard roll. I'll cut it. And take it back to the machine. What have you got here? Oh, uh, uh, this. Let's stick it on. There. And we'll attach the roll here. Oh, I don't like this glue gun much. You can get burned with it. But Sue has always taught me to be careful. Our cookie shoot is done. Sam, bring me the lid. Uh, which lid? Oh, do I have to do everything myself? But I know nothing about the lid. You haven't told me. Hm. All right. I've cut it out already. I just need to glue the holder on. Something else? Or perhaps we can make our viewers happy now. Yes, we can. Ta-da! Our machine is done. <laughs> we only need to decorate it and then load it up with cookies. Will this do? A cookie package <laughs> label? Sure. <laughs> and here's the past to cookie paradise. <laughs> well, the words are lopsided, but it'll do. Lopsided? But it's a creation by Sam the Great! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, is it time yet? Time to load the cookies? It's time! Let's go! <laughs> An important moment! Drum roll! Insert the card. And here comes the cookie. Mm. <laughs> and me? What about me? Here, but only one. Fine. Yay! Thumbs up if you liked our marvelous cookie machine. And I'm off. Unsubscribe to the channel. By the way, guys, did you like Samantha? If you want her to appear in our videos more often, write that in the comments. Hey, that's all for now. See you soon. Bye, everyone. Give me back my cookie.